Let me through. That would not go backwards. I, I would assume not, but it seemed like every other way I went wasn't working. You just gotta be more careful. Oh yeah, you might go this way. Oh. And then turn right, probably. Yeah. Because generally when you see a map this big, you should assume they're going to use all of it. See, you know this, I mean? this isn't fun to me. This is just tedious. Yeah, I kind of like this kind of stuff. <laughs> you want me to do it? No. <laughs> do you not want to do it? Yeah, well, look everywhere I go. It's getting mad at me. You can do it. Ra, ra, ra. I believe in I'm just going to... That's going to just... I'm just gonna make it's gonna make me just want to run through it. I'm gonna say I mean, no, I can't. <laughs> I mean, that is the upside. Is at uh, least it destroys that chunk, so you can really clearly see that it's not. You can really clearly see where the wrong spots are. They were even nice enough to take out two of them at once on the far left over there. Oh, the Colin went out. They know they're like this girl needs like, help. Seriously, this is a wall. Don't go this way. Blip 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 blip. Not that I way. Imagine, I think you go right here. Maybe. Oh my god, you really committed. <laughs> <laughs> you just suddenly like, you were just something like fuck it. So I think you're I think you're being too sensitive to the diff it, it pulsing. It has different speeds. So when it just pulses a little bit, you're still like a whole tile away. There you go. It's when it starts getting aggressive is when you're about to walk right into it. Ta-da! You did it. Do you feel proud of yourself? Was that satisfying gameplay to you? No. Dang. <laughs> Guess I'll have to try again. Maybe in the third game we play, there'll be good gyms. <laughs> in the third wow, game? Wow, this looks annoying. <laughs> I mean, I don't... I don't know if I've seen a lot of gym ideas that were great. They're usually recycled ideas from other games. Like, these are all... Well, I kind of run out of ideas after familiar. a while. Like, when we, when we did the Switches puzzle, it was like, I've played this puzzle before. <laughs> and I'm, I'm extra I'm extra aware of this because I have a whole dedicated time slot to puzzle games. It's like, I think it was Rock, Paper, Shotgun called them the Elder Puzzles. The puzzles that repeat everywhere all the time and then get transplanted from game to game. Like, uh, Lights Out, the one where you press, a, you press a tile and all the ones adjacent to it change between being on or off. Yeah. Like that one. Or, uh, Towers of Hanoi. Someone's looking at put me. Put the rings from the left pillar to the right pillar, but you can only stack things on things that are bigger than them. You can't yeah. put big things on top that, of small that's things. That's a classic puzzle. Yep. I played three different Bioware games that have that same puzzle in it. It's like, come on, guys. Um, I look at these puzzles we we do for the gyms, and they're all elder puzzles. They're all really familiar things. <clears throat> he is not a grass type, in case you didn't know. <laughs> It's the plot twist every time. I know. Look at him, he's such a cutie. Like one of the better gym ideas might have been the waterfall one, but that was definitely really a really standard switch puzzle. Oh yeah. But was it was a... more interesting than some of the other ones they've done. I mean the You whole... crit once. If only they had more than one Pokemon, mm. you could really get this going. Well also I, my my secondary motivation is I just want to level them up a little bit. Go Oh gosh. Uh, uh... Yeah. Well, you can tell it was a powerful move because it got damaged by recoil. Like, any move that takes recoil is usually pretty good. That was scary. It's okay. Don't kill Farfetch'd. I need him to level. I just can't kill Ice Boogies. He Everyone else doesn't, doesn't worry about getting KO'd. Woo! Even though I know you were there, I couldn't see a path of victory. That's a great voice, Keith. That's exactly how I thought she would sound like. Yeah, I knew it. Obviously. They should hire me for the show. So I can make more money. <laughs> I, I haven't seen. I still can make more money. They still make the show. I'm surprised. Yeah, I was gonna say. I wonder. I how... keep seeing screenshots of Pokemon that already have Galar Pokemon in it. I'm like, wow, it's really still going. I wonder how the reception of the show is. Like, do people like know. it? Does it still watch? Do people? I never, I never hear about it. I only hear people reference episodes from like the, the from the Kanto and Johto regions. Well, we're all because well, all was, those people was are. Was Kanto the first one? Is that the name of it? Yeah. Yeah. But all those people are like your age. Yeah. So, so I only, it hear, makes I, only sense. I only hear references of people watching the first two regions. Because you're not talking to children. Yeah. You're only talking to people like your yeah, age. This is, it. <laughs> is that how kids The only sound? person. Uh, I mean, there. I do know one person that obsessively watches every anime. 
So they might be watching Pokemon still. Is it me? No, it's I'm Andrew. Just, I'm just kidding. I don't. I have you a are an anime underachiever by his standards. Well, I am because I'm very, very, very particular. I will not spend my time on no, something he watches, that I think is worthless. He's indiscriminate. <laughs> no, I'm very discriminatory. I got a lot of shit for not liking Gurren Logan. <laughs> <laughs> It's okay. I knew I, I knew that would be an unpopular. There's opinion. this uh, there's this video, there's this viral video of a guy. I just don't like things that are fun and happy. There's a there's a viral video. Pokemon's of a, my least favorite. Uh, thing. There's a viral video of this guy like bilging, like he's oh he's taking a Ugh. he's taking a bucket and filling it with water from the sidewalk and pouring it over into the into the creek in Venice, like pouring it into the canal. Yeah. But the joke is, of course, that the canal's flooded over the sidewalk, so he's just <laughs> he's just pouring water from his feet to water over there because it's all underwater and he's fucked, and. Andrew retweeted that saying me adding an anime to my watch list <laughs> It's about right his his my anime list or whatever website he uses is terrifying It's like more man hours than I've ever spent on any form of media as far as I can tell because he's just always watching anime Well, you know, I think it's a really underappreciated art form <laughs> And I say that genuinely it sounds like a joke, but I mean it um, I fucking hate this puzzle I'm and, getting and, really salty. And much like you, he's a big ol' snob about it. <laughs> All anime is garbage except these really specific ones. But, but he watches it indiscriminately, you just said. Yeah, but he Chris, but he's but he's really mad a lot of it. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, that, that makes it better. I see. I like. I understand he, that more. He has a lot of experience by which to call all these things garbage. You just gotta watch Paranoia Agent. With me I don't know. If, I should see. Happy. I should see if he has access to that somewhere. Hey, Andrew, Because I want please. to watch all of it. It's like, He's the most likely person to have it somewhere. It's my favorite one. Um, the most, I think the most mainstream thing he consistently watches and actually likes is One Piece. He's a big fan of One Piece. I just can't. There's just too many. Yo, it's too, ho, it's too ho, long. take a bite of gum gum. There, there are some that I think uh, people who don't like anime might still like. like. There's some weird kind of artsy ones. I think you'd like like the Tommy Galaxy or something. One of these days, I'm probably gonna watch Space Dandy. Please watch Space. You see Cowboy time, but, Bebop? But first, I need to watch Cowboy yeah, Bebop. Yeah, I was like, "Fuck you, gotta watch Cowboy Bebop." I've seen, only seen random episodes of it when it was on, like Tsunami or something. <sighs> oh my gosh, I'm getting. Up. I'm working I'm on getting, it. No, I'm not. I no. got, I got the box sets up there. They're only twenty dollars of uh, both Avatar shows. So I'm gonna get through those probably. That, that like. But at some point, I'll probably get to, to Cowboy. That exhalation I, I, I just I wanna, gave. I want to watch Cowboy Bebop and Gurren Lagann and Space Dandy. And Castlevania. I won't watch Gurren Lagann with you. There's a lot of anime. I still need to watch <laughs> the second season of, of Kaiji. What? what? I got bored when they were playing dice for 10 episodes. Jeez. It was a lot of dice. I wanted more death games. They <laughs> are. They get to that. The dice is boring. Keep, they get to it's that. It's a lot of dice. <laughs> I will say the first season's much look better. At that, look at that fucking Pokemon anime ass X on your feet. That's an iconic thing from the- oh my god, what are you? What am I- Gordy's a lot to take in. <laughs> Hi, Gordy. Hi, Gordy. I'm oh, sorry. Um, I- I'm, you oh. wanna- do you have a Jim Gordy voice? Your voice is already instantly uh, better. I admit I feel a little bad for doing this to a gym challenger, but... I'm gonna use this match to show the crowd that my Pokémon are unbeatable. I'm gonna do my hair just like this. <laughs> That's a lot to take in. That's like a JoJo hairdo. <laughs> So let's get this over with, Challenger. No, it's not a JoJo hairdo. This is a Yu-Gi-Oh hairdo. My one criticism of JoJo's is that, hey, JoJo's, I can't animate, or I can't cosplay any of your stuff because it's freaking impossible. Yeah. So Jordy. You set me up, up for failure. They made the character with the name Jordy wear a visor. You notice that? Yes. What does this mean? The character with the visor from Star Trek Next Generation's name is Jordy. It's LeVar Burton from Reading Rainbow. Really? Yeah, he plays Jordy LaForge in all of Star Trek Next Generation, every season. Okay. <clears throat> <laughs> um, <laughs> I'm really amused by the idea that you recognize him better from, <laughs> from Reading Rainbow. Well, I mean, who doesn't like Reading Rainbow? I never watched it. Um, in school, I had to watch it all the time, and that guy was uh, charming and very soothing. Um, okay, I gotta remember, Barbacle is fighting, but I think he's water for sure, and also he's hideous, and I hate looking at him. You think he's fighting water? I think so. rock gym? He's a... Oh, no, sorry, sorry, I meant to say rock okay. water. Sorry, rock... I, I, or, or hang on a minute. rock fighting, but he's he's a barnacle, so he's he should be water, right? He's, I don't know, but he's rock. Why would you make it's him a barnacle gym. if you're not gonna make him... Yeah, he's water. <gasps> what was that they just did to me? Cool, Barra, no! We'll fix him, we'll fix him. He's water, so I can't use Sir Dranky, right? 
Water, water, water is... Steel, steel? does half against water. Really? Oh, yeah. Mm. Water does... Wait, wait, water? Then I should be using Willem. Water does... I should use Willem. Water does normal against steel, but steel does ability against water. But it, Willem's not good because he's a rock. Oh, fuck. Wait, no, Willem... Oh, I know, Willem's no, fine. No, yeah. no, sorry, I was thinking yeah. of... I was thinking of, uh... Toxitricity. Toxtricity. Tox to toxicity in our city, in our city. Toxicity in my city. In my city. Disorder. Disorder. Have you ever looked at the lyrics to that song? Probably. It's kind of fucking weird. No, I've definitely looked at the lyrics because I, I used to sing the song a lot, in, a lot in rock band. Eating seeds as a pastime activity. Eating seeds as a pastime activity. Um, I like flashlight reveries caught in. Oh, wait. Reveries caught in the headlights of a truck. It's kind of. I don't know. It's got some cool <laughs> things. We, uh, no, we. Shuckle. I in should, our, I'm in our keep... most popular series of all time, Shuckle. Tokyo Jungle, Andrew and I would sing that song Shuckle. every episode because just that was a game where you never get a city full of toxicity. Toxicity. <laughs> you had the toxicity in meter that was city. building up because like poison clouds would start showing up everywhere. In my city. So we couldn't not think of that every time. I like BYOB more though. Um. Uh, I think I think I like toxicity more. I like aerials. I actually like a lot of the. Uh, there's a lot of good that sits down. down, yeah. I had a, a boyfriend in high school who it's a I hope violent pornography. I love that song. Choking chicks inside of me. Inside of me. Um he'll never know, but like I I was like, oh system of a down I like I like it's, I was like ah ha ha but secretly I was like I love System of a Down. And I and to this day he doesn't know that I like it and it's his thanks to him and I won't give him any credit and I hope he never hears me say that. <laughs> but thank you, stranger who I won't name. I like to smooth it down because of you, you dumbass. <laughs> okay. The experience of like actually liking media but not wanting to like the media because well, you don't like the person. I don't person. like the person, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, no, I get that. That's part of my brotherly rivalry. No credit rivalry. for you. No credit for you. That's, that's an element of my brotherly rivalry is that my brother won't listen, won't like any band that I like right. by, on principle. So I have to like sneak it into his life no, and, then, and then he has to forget that it's from me and then he'll start liking it and then like, ha ha, I got you. You should just let me have something, and then I'll show it to him. And I'll say, that's great. And then he'll that, say, that, actually, it was like, me all along. My brother got really into Rise Against for a while. And it just it was from a magic CD that just fucking spontaneously arrived in his room one day. And it's like, this is my, this is my fucking CD. <laughs> it was my CD of, of, uh, of Rise Against. Because I knew he'd like them. But I couldn't let him learn mm. from me that they existed. Rock tune. So I had to, like, I'd like sleuth the album into his bedroom. And then he became a Rise Against fan. I... Anything to make him stop listening to Three Days Grace. <laughs> um, it's not too late. No, it's, never it's too definitely late. too late. That, I hope that band's buried. <laughs> I remember, like, I remember being a little angst- Okay, I would be a little angsty kid and being like, This song's so... It's so deep. This so game, deep. this song gets me. I want to point out that pain without love, pain. pain I can't get enough. enough. <laughs> I want to point out that Gordy's like facing the other way, like a badass, and looking. <laughs> Is he though? He Is that the word for it? I guess. He's having to hold, the, hold that pose for a long time. It's really embarrassing. It is kind of, but but. Gordy's like, I already committed, I can't... Yeah. <laughs> I can't turn around now. He's gonna do this entire duel in this pose that says, Oh, I didn't see you there. Hi. <laughs> oh, hi. I didn't see you there. My name is Stephanie. His hair reminds me of uh, Yu-Gi-Oh. Specifically the part where, like, there's the original Yu-Gi-Oh, where Yu-Gi had completely unidentifiably impossible hair that you, could never, that you couldn't understand. Like, Yugi's hair is impossible to comprehend. You can't even interpret, like, what it's supposed to be. He's just a bizarre, multi-stage starfish with 12 different hair colors, and he has, like, a backdrop to his hair, but also, like, he's got, like... It's like a fucking, like, spider web, like... It's like one of those, like, those neck pieces that would, like, go up and, like, a, like to frame the back of the head of, like, a queen, or, like, an evil villain in a Disney movie. Like the like the ladies would have the big extravagant dresses where like there's a headdress thing that goes behind their head that goes up and stuff like that. That's just actual just fuck. It's just his real fucking hair. Like Yugi's impossible. 
Everyone else in that show, like Tristan, is a, has a weird spike for a head, Whoa. and you, and Joey has a pompadour, and a bunch of other people have like different, like slightly wacky hair. But Yugi is like a fucking, like it's a it's a puzzle what his hair is. So, but, I that, but what happened is then they, when that entire story was over, they made like a dual academy show that's all new characters and some sort of card dual monsters like academy school thing, and it's a whole new thing to keep that money train going forever. That was every character. It was 500 Yu-Gi-Oh! OCs. Like how everyone has their, their Sonic OC that's like, Trevor the Hedgehog, <laughs> he's green and he has a skateboard. Like it was 500 copies of Yu-Gi and it was terrifying. <laughs> the entire cast, every hero, every oh. villain was a fucking Yu-Gi nightmare clone OC. That was a real show that happened. <laughs> You killed Stonehenge. Do you feel good about yourself? Well, was that removing a wonder from the world? Forty's last Pokemon. No. Okay. He has four. If it was his last Pokemon, I would have Dynamaxed. That, that that's that's what I was concerned about. I thought maybe I fucked Cole it up. Colossal. I want to <gasps> say that's the other one. It's <laughs> gonna be the third form of the stupid one that we don't like. So let's see what we could have had. We're not gonna be jealous. <laughs> gonna we're be, gonna, we're he's gonna, gonna be stupid head. I don't forgot already what it was with the voice. Not was. yet. Blah 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 blah. blah, blah. Yeah, yeah. Battle. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm not jealous. I hate it. What the fuck? What is he? Why is his face a shoe? <laughs> <laughs> Isn't it? His face is a shoe. Are we gonna see Dynamax Farfetched? Um, that's what I was gonna try to do. Hopefully, I don't die. I'm a little concerned, actually. You might, you might die horribly. You never know. Whoa. He got angrier. I mean, that's better. Than the other one. <laughs> oh, fuck. I, oh, he's chewing. Whoa, mm. so much. A critical hit, though. Yay. Just do that. You just use him as a punching bag. I hope I don't die. Yeah, about that. <sighs> so about that. You just got him killed twice. How many times has he crit so far? Just once? I think if he dies, it I don't think it counts. It might not count. I don't think it counts. But how many honest. times has he crit? Uh, I think twice, oh, actually. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Um, let's see. What, I don't know, man. Ground. Know. Wait, wait. Ground against fire is good, right? Uh, he... <clears throat> ground is good against fire, but it's good ground against rock? Yes, ground's good against rock. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna okay. bitch this one out. Just for a minute. Pain. With Stop. Love. No. Pain. You can't, can't get, get enough. enough. Um, we don't wanna. I'm gonna. And people called my chemical romance emo. Uh, <laughs> and then unironically listened to Three Days Grace. <laughs> people don't know what they're talking about. And and. They unironically listened to Three Days Grace and Lincoln Park, but then we're like, ew, emo. If this boy can take a hit for a second. I just wanna I wanna see This is a good move. Fuck. Oh, it's oh a my. good Oh he's alive. He tucked he, it out. He, he tucked it out because he, he loves us. us. Please. Oh, don't oh, feel you sad. Poor baby, but I kinda need you to die so I can switch out in one hit. Oh. <laughs> That's not nice. <laughs> So we're gonna let him die. No. Yeah, we're gonna let him die. <laughs> Poor boy. Let's we'll see if we can get one hit in before he dies, though. Well, if he's using dig, he's gonna leave. Yeah, but he's gonna run out of Dynamax power, and then I can switch out, and then my Farfetch oh, will be right. Dynamax. That's a smart move you're doing there. Size me, strength saver the pain. Yeah, just don't use a just don't use a earthquake, <laughs> please. Fuck, I almost killed him in one move. Jesus. I remember Duel Academy. I remember seeing it on there. I'm trying to remember how dumb their hair was. It was it was it was a problem. We're still in Dynamax for fun. Yeah. And by fun, I mean kill. Max Knuckle. This guy's gonna die. The hope of crits. <laughs> it's our last chance. I don't. I really think if you die, it's not gonna count. Well, only one way to find out. 
Well, to be honest, it might have only been one time, so I it's can't say for sure. It's I, big boy. Oh, you heal and you Dynamax. No, you don't. It just, it just, it just, sh it just oh, like... Oh, it just shows the meter again. It just again. being flashy. Max Knuckle. <laughs> I'm about to give her Max Knuckle. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> Is that how I die? <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna. I'll add that to my likelihoods of death. Falling down the stairs, Max Knuckle. In cells. In cells. <laughs> no one's gonna understand what I'm talking about. You fear in cells. I normal do. Fear. And you no, also, and you also just... fear that your dog's gonna trip you down the stairs, which is yeah. also a very normal threat because your dog's a lunatic. I have a list of. of Ways that I feel like non-natural ways that I feel like are likely that I will die from, like 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 freak yeah. accidents, and those are on my on my list of like top ten now. I'll put I, Max Knuckle on that list. I just want to climb into a hole. Well, I guess it'd be more like falling from here. Whoa, nice pose, bro. You're really this necklace and this haircut. I really don't like you. This is a problem. <laughs> I can see why they swapped you out. Everything about him is a problem. I wonder if the other game got a better one. Maybe. That was impressive. Rules are rules. Here, take this rock badge. Were you thinking of not giving the fucking badge? Is that what you're considering? He, he has heels. Can they do that? Did you see that he has heels? Oh, uh, let me see. We almost have, wow, we have six of them out of eight. We're getting there. Doop, 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 Level doop, 50. Doop, 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 We're not even close. Oh, don't worry about me. I just need to train harder, that's all. I wasn't Why worried about you. Why would I worry you? about a gym leader? Get over yourself. You have, a, you have a secure job. I'm not worried about yeah, you. I wonder, do they get paid? Yes. I. What? They'd have to. Does anyone... Unless this is like a society where you don't need money to survive. It, it kind of seems that way. Yeah. At Rock Tomb, yeah. that's a good one. Pokemon Universe might be socialist. You might just have universal basic income. So you can go seek out your dreams of catching Pokemon, and then the Pokemon do all the real labor. As we're, show we're sitting here, when you go to the computer and tell them to do jobs for you. What a world. All the Pokemon are out there no doing a gig econ it. economy, and all the humans aren't working at all. Mm. Gotta catch them all. Gotta catch them all, labor force. <laughs> That's terrifying. Everyone can learn Snore. But, but should anyone learn Snore? That's um, the question. Oh, he, oh that, I just I like Kabu, but I think I'll cheer for that trainer now. I switched somebody. Who's this person? From switched Kabu. those ominous. Uh, a match? No, <laughs> nothing interesting. <laughs> ha, ha ha ha! All these people are just here to fill the room. Hello. That battle was brilliant. That gym leader was tough, but you had no trouble. Churchester has some really great restaurants. I got some, some things I want to talk to you about, so let's head to a restaurant to celebrate your win. The name of the restaurant is Bob's Your Uncle. <laughs> the only restaurant we've seen. Yeah. Oh. Uh, right? Didn't we eat somewhere else when we met up with uh, Rose? No, no, I mean, in this town. Even though we never eat at these places, we just stand in them and then walk away. Well, she said this town has some great restaurants, but there's only one restaurant we saw in this town. Nobody serves us food. Do, do, do. This would be a great time for one of those like food porn moments that video games are really good at, but this game doesn't really do that. Well, the, the curry kind of looks good. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, there is that one moment part where the show's food. Hop, I didn't invite you on my date. Got the gym badge, Keith, and you nice one. Oh hey, there you are. I've been trying to find out more about the Darkest Day and the Sword and Shield Pokemon, but still, no luck. Wait. <laughs> Hold on. We knew this was gonna happen. Yeah, the, I called it last episode. The moment episode. that, that tapestry showed up, I was like, like "That looks can't important." Wait for the, can't wait for the story to take us here. Right after we get the gym badge, but his <clears throat> face is terrifying. Yeah, Bob. Bob is not my uncle. <laughs> no way. What's this? I think it's little Bob and all of us. An absolutely fantastic poster. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> exactly! Bob with his brilliant smile must be a part of the legend. Um. Wait, what are you on about? Don't confuse me! <laughs> I wish Bob was a part of the legend. Oh my god. No, I don't. <laughs> the heroes look sad. And where are the sword and shield? 
on the bottom of the tapestry. What was the meaning of this picture? You totally took one of those pictures where it's a little version of you, then a big ghostly version of your that's, head. That's the one that we're all going to take together. Yeah, that's totally what we're all going to do a, a portrait. Took. Keith and I are going to do a portrait, and then Bob and my Everyone face is going to be big. Everyone in our household's going to dress up like a '90s like awkward family. We're going to take a and picture we're together. Take a terrible. It's picture my Christmas. It's the Christmas present that I want this thrift, year. Thrift stores for stupid shirts. I already, I've already said I got lots of those. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Perhaps when their duty was completed, they went into some kind of sleep. Based on oh, sorry. Based on those statues we saw back in Soan side, the sword and the shield were actually two Pokemon, right? That's right. That's my take on it, at least. You remember the Pokemon we met that day? Do you think it could have been one of them, either the sword or the shield Pokemon? You met them? Oh right, when we met the wolf, it didn't have a sword, right? It was just standing there. I don't remember. I don't think it had a sword in its mouth. I think it was just a wolf. A big scary wolf. Like it's gonna draw them. <gasps> it's gonna it's gonna draw the master sword in the, in the lost woods, and then it's gonna be the chosen one. So what does the the shield one do? Just ruffle its fur out? It runs really hard into the master <laughs> shield. Which is a thing that exists now. And then it just head pierces through the middle, and now it's a shield push sword. It's, listen, the wolf doesn't understand how to use shields. <laughs> One of them is much cooler than the other. It uses a shield by sticking its most vulnerable and important part of its entire body its to the face. other side of the shield. <laughs> so it can't shield anything but other people, basically. It's a really stupid Pokemon. This is the reason why I picked this Pokemon sword. <laughs> I was just going to pick the shield to be nice to everyone else I knew. <laughs> Come on, you know what I'm talking about, right, Keithany? Our apple would have been better, though. Yeah, but our game would have been worse. Well, whatever. I mean, then we could have gotten probably a cooler ice gym. Uh, in the slumbering wheel. Exactly. The mad Pokemon we ran into the f we ran into in the fog. Don't you think that could have been it? Oh, that's right. You lot have been in the slumbering wheel. I only started on this journey because my grand told me to, but this is turning out to be too much fun! You've got to tell me more. How about we discuss this over a meal? Go on, what do you want to eat? Let's get our orders in! Dude, we're actually gonna eat? They're not gonna show it though. Fascinating! Alright, the next thing to do now that we're, in, that we're done eating is to have a look around Tertiaire. Let's here, here, inspect here, here, here. the hero's bath. I can't accept this name; it's too silly. I feel like that this is like one of the most normal, or some one of the most like realistic names we've heard. Church is church. Yeah, so I'm, I'm checking, and uh, the fourth gym on Pokemon Shield would have been a guy who looks like he's wearing a mischief maker's like ghost mask, and he's and, and he was a ghost trainer. But we got, but we got the fighting lady, lady B. I like the. So they're different gyms. I like the other one. They're different gyms. Dude, it was her name was Alistair. And the Pokemon Shield Churchyshire gym is Melanie, who does ice. I like that so one better. It was an ice gym, but we got, we got Gort Jordy. Yay! Ew. So at least two of them switch out. Okay. That's interesting to know. It is interesting to know. It's I, I mean the replay value goes up for me between the two versions if they actually differ in gameplay somewhere besides just having some Pokemon switched out. It is a nice touch. Because the Pokemon being switched out is like, eh, there's so many of them that's barely noticeable. Like I said, I'll, I'll look for path. a handful of important ones like Caterpie and Gyarados, who's in every one. <clears throat> uh, the Caterpie Heroes only path. evolves you if you can, evolves if you can give it the hot pants. <laughs> Where do I find the hot pants item? In the hot spring, obviously. In the pants it's right store, there in the name. obviously. They say this is where the two heroes came to soothe their wounds after the battle to bring down that evil presence long ago. Nowadays, only Pokemon really <laughs> use the hero's bath, though. Sorry. You are right. <laughs> yeah, I just huffed and puffed and blew the house down. Hmm. Who exactly were the heroes that, ba that bathed here? I think I'll have to look into that. You two met a mysterious Pokemon back in the slumbering wield. Perhaps you two can become new heroes. What, like some hero waving around a sword and shield? Pull the other one. 
though I guess I'd fancy a shield if I had to take my pick. Oh. oh. Don't let him have it. Wait, so, so that means that Ugh. in the other game he probably says sword. Can't she have it instead? Yeah, I don't <laughs> Just want to hop out of the story. Please. <laughs> but yeah, in the other game he probably says. It's also sad if the researcher doesn't sword. even get to have one of them. Just she, some random loser gets to have it. I like her some much guy who better. Can't even beat the, he can't even beat the rock gym. Well, she suggested that we could be two heroes. She doesn't want to be a part of that. Oh, yeah. What kind of battle do you think the heroes had back then? What are we sure, Keithney? Think we can pull off a real heroic battle? You, you will be crushed. Yeah. Fuck you. <laughs> Someone who cheated us to a great meal. After that curry, I feel like I've got the energy to wrestle a beware. Um... I don't entirely understand your reasoning, but I might as well see what you can do. I'll hear Pokemon up for you, Keithany. Okay. So give it your best. I was about to say, have we healed since the gym? I thought maybe the food would have healed us. So I don't I... think anyone was really hurt, but still. Time for a little exhibition match, starring the future champion. He doesn't stand a I'm chance. I'm a punk-ass bitch. He does not stand a chance. How does that hair happen? Oh, <laughs> oh it evolved. It's got little horns. Finally. He is capable of evolving Pokemon. Counting on you, partner. He, pr he should finally... Did he have third form water last time? Yeah. We kicked his Weird. ass. That already happened. Um, yeah, we one-shot him, didn't we? Because <laughs> really Boom's bullshit. Is this thing just... Uh... Try to crit them all. Good luck. Thank you. I think it's just a normal Pokemon, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Fighting's good against normal, isn't it? Why is it that strong? Well, I think I think this is gonna do super damage because it just hurt me so much. Are we in trouble? <laughs> no, that's a proper move, dude. I think I really do think that um, Kuwabara is gonna be kind of a. I think his defense is not the greatest. I, we can look at it after this, but yeah, he is lower level than everything we fight, though, too. I don't think birds are inherently that. I don't know. I, I feel like they kind of they, they kind of think about things like that when they. I don't know. When Maybe his stats. defense will be better when he has a shield. <laughs> um, steel flying. I should use ice. No, steel's good against ice, right? No. God damn! I'm never gonna remember steel. Um, ice bookies. <laughs> Ice is ice is weak against steel. No, oh, they're not that. Steel is weak against fighting, ground, and fire. Mm. And it's strong against almost everything. Cool. Hooray! I should leave Kuabara out then. You should heal Kuabara. I should though, yeah. Corviknight. Mm. I'm just too nervous to eat berries. I see I'm, I'm gonna heal him, but it's gonna take a hit from us, so we'll see what we can do. I might have to switch him out anyway. Maybe. Fighting does times two against steel. Well, maybe he won't be able to do oh, it. Oh, but it does half against flying. Oh. Ah. Fuck. Why was that did, super effective? Did he use a flying attack? Oh, you know, damn it. I, I forget that our guy isn't flying. No, That's so we're stupid. just fighting. It's very, it's a little confusing. It's weird. Well, he'll be, uh, electric will be good against flying. But electric is a terrible so. choice. But it's good against flying. No, it's not. Yeah, it is. Wait, electric. Yeah, no. Yeah, it is. Mm, oh, there it is. I just killed him. Yeah, electric strong against flying. And we, and normal against steel. Okay. It's such a big grid to read that it's easy to like accidentally jump over to the next adjacent like column or row when you're trying to line the two of them up. I'm trying I'm trying a dual type comparison. Two types on our Pokemon versus two types on their Pokemon and try to check all the, the cross sections. It's it's a it's a it's a process. It's a lot to deal with. Are you gonna spank either Dranky? No, I mean, I, honestly, I, fighting would have been good against Snorlax, but it's, you know, our little Is guy's dead. Just normal? Yeah. We're gonna poison him. 
because I think he's gonna do some dumb bullshit with rest or something. <laughs> I don't remember if rest heals status effects. It might, though. Don't use rest. Otherwise, he just dies in his sleep. <laughs> yeah. Snorlax never woke up. Well, Aww. you know, th th that's the way to go. Live in the dream. Die in the dream. If you die in the dream, you die in real life. Dang. If you die in the dream, you die for real. This is that one that does more damage if you have a status effect. Like, I think if you're poisoned. Yeah. You better watch do -do, out. Do -do, do -do. You better watch out. It's okay, we'll switch him out. Hail scary. Or heal him up. We're gonna heal him up. Ba -ba -ba, I don't want, I want the other, this one. We're getting too powerful for our super potions. They don't heal us that much anymore. Mm -hmm. See, that one didn't even heal us up all the way. See, I didn't want to switch anyone else out because then they would just get damaged with this guy too. So I might as well like let Ivanus take a hit. Is a hyper heal like 125? 120? You mean the, the um... Hyper potion? Yeah. You can do it. Because it's hot and it's very easy to defeat. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna do that. <laughs> oh no. Doesn't he have two water Pokemon now? Mm, so he's just doomed? Does he have two? Hello, Antelion. You have no chance. We're gonna, um, and it's, it's kind of a waste. But, you know, we got all this money and all that. I'm gonna, uh, get our guy back in the game so he can earn some points. Cause he's a little level. points. Yeah. It, and there's no way this guy's gonna take in, down. We get into a loop of our weakest Pokemon fanning and then leaving them fan it all fight. <laughs> he just cried at us. So sad. Now crush him. Yes, um... Pop his head like melon between thigh. Between thigh. He just keeps crying at us. Why do you keep crying at us? He's lame. Well, he's trying destroy to... Destroy him. <laughs> we are too metal for your tears. Your tears just water. Water our plants. Hey, Hop. Have you considered that maybe you lose all your Pokemon duels because you just fucking cry at everybody instead of fighting? <laughs> Pro tip. Your starter just cries at people. Maybe at Lurin attacks. Pinchurchin. This is... I don't remember this one. It's a pincurchin. <laughs> it's a pincurchin. Is it a... I don't remember this one. <laughs> Yep. Oh, he's cute. He's Look so at his cute. little butt oh face. Why is there so many butt faces? Oh, he's so cute. How many butt faces are there in this game? I, mu I must just think all the butt faces are cute because I really think he's. You didn't like the other cute. butt face, did you? Which one? The one from the beginning of the game. It was not good. Is it a squirrel? It might have been a squirrel. That, well, I hate that. There was something squirrel. that had a butt face. I can't remember anymore. We got to go back to like episode like five or something. Where we kind of the butt face. Oh, he just cursed us. Oh. Is it poison water? Because it's an urchin? I think I think so. Because it's a pincurchin? Pincurchin? There's a lot of poison water types. It's oh, like, it's pincurchin. Like, urchin. Yeah, he's, yeah. Urchin. <laughs> that, that's actually really but cute. It's a pincurchin. I love him. That's, that's, a, that's a very punny name. That's great. Why are his eyes triangles? Why not? I guess we'll never know. Especially when we murder him right now. He just keeps using status effects on us. Hop sucks. Does he not know I'm gonna kill him in the next hit? Yeah, I don't think he gets how this works. I think he's trying to like get all buffed up, but he's gonna he's gonna die in just two hits, so I thought, I thought maybe that would take him out. The saddest thing that would happen is if you proceed through the game and then Hop just loses one of his Pokemon. <laughs> You're like, what what happens? Did he not survive the last fight? <laughs> Did I kill him? I think he already switched one out. I don't know. We got a new move. 
wood Whoa. hammer. Dang. It also damages us quite a lot, though. This is going to be like a Hail How Mary. Much is quite a lot. It's going to be a Hail Mary. So this is going to be if Willem the Best has to die so we can switch somebody else out. These are both really good, though. It's a lot of power. It's a significant amount of pow. Pow pow. We're going to get rid of this physical move. And learn wood hammer instead. I think this might be a unique move. Ice Boogie's leveled up, but does he love you? Mm. Let's find out. <laughs> Oh, Hop. You will never beat me. I I swear that's my one promise. I hope. <laughs> is that Hop at the very Has least, anyone ever beaten Hop us? Hop doesn't know. Aside from like one or two Pokemon in the wild we ran from. Because well, they were they scary. They didn't technically beat us. We they ran were away. They were scary and we ran. Thanks. Mostly because they slept a lot. The scariest thing I a Pokemon can do is sleep. That freaking squirrel, dude. <laughs> right, we need to go back and kill it sometime. Yeah. End of the game. Just go Life back and goals. kill it. Thanks. You two gave a right proper battle. At the rate you two, you both are going, even the unbeatable Leon may be in trouble. So what's next, you two? I plan to look into things in the slumbering wield. Is that what we're calling a right proper battle now? A fucking blowout? A right proper battle? I'm gonna keep challenging that gym. Oh, sorry. I'm gonna keep challenging that gym. This is my boy voice. <laughs> yep, that's the difference. Then once I get that gym badge, I'll be heading to Route 9 to take on Spike Muth next. Spike Muth? That sounds like a cool guy. The next is it the town or the person? I don't know. I hope I think, it's a person. I think, Smi I think Spike Muth is a place. Aw, oh, man. Like I want it to be like some Innsmouth. badass. Like Innsmouth is a place. Yeah, but Spike Muth sounds like a punk, punk ass, like, it singer in a I rock Spike band. Mouth. <laughs> I am Spike Muth. So you have teeth? <laughs> Spike Muth. I'm Spike, Spike Muth. Spike Mouth. Seems like he finally shook off that gloom. Leon Worry. Leon worried if Hop wasn't feeling all right. Leon worry if <laughs> Hop. That was a weird sentence. Leon would worry. As his rival, you wouldn't like it either, right? Wrong. <laughs> See ya. I would love it if he I was worried and unhappy. In, I want to drown him over there in the bath. Oh gosh. <laughs> it's just Hop is just slowly floating, like fucking like Gatsby <laughs> in, the, in the in the pond. <laughs> just say I don't know how he died. <laughs> He just dies off camera 90% of the way into the story. I don't know how it happened. It's crazy. He didn't have any enemies or anything, right? 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 <laughs> definitely not everyone. <laughs> not Definitely not every person he ever encountered. <laughs> A lot of people have the coal thing. I think you just catch the Pokemon to be warm. I put one in my house. <laughs> You know, I feel like eventually Pokemon like the, just gets like the Flintstones. It's like the goddamn Himalayan salt lamp of Pokemon. <laughs> like it's just there for utility purpose. People don't use that Pokemon. for warmth. No, this it's, is what came to mind. It's for spiritual awareness. I think it's supposed to be the like some bullshit about ions like yeah making you rejuvenated or something. It's some hot bullshit. Um, I think there was. I just want to look really. Mm, where do we you know there? it's bullshit because Joe Rogan believes in it. Oh gosh. <laughs> That's always step one to this is a dumb thing. Let's see what these strangers have. I love having snowball fights with my Pokemon. Yay! In the snow town, right? Where the snow gym is? This dumb kid. Oh. <laughs> if only there were warm snow, we could play outside a lot more. Wow. That I award you no points and may God have mercy on your soul. Oh no. Kids going places. You silly child. How off-putting would warm snow be? I feel like I know. I was just thinking that. It's kind of gross. <laughs> um, I already knew that dragon type Pokemon don't like ice types. Yeah. Silly guy. All right, off to Spike Muth. But we don't need a haircut. We're doing good, right? I, be, I, I, I believe in us. I'll be offer more haircuts.